another excellent question. Ashok has a bag containing 40 cards numbered from integers from 1 to 40. No two cards are numbered with the same integer. Likewise, his sister Shilpa has another bag containing only 5 cards that are numbered with integers from 1 to 5, but no integer repeating. So Ashok has a bag which has 1, 2, 3, 4, all the way till 40. Shilpa has another bag which has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Their mother Lata randomly draws one card each from Ashok's and Shilpa's bags and notes down their respective numbers. If Lata divides the number obtained from Ashok's bag by the number obtained from Shilpa's, what is the probability the remainder will not be greater than 2? I take a number from here, x, a number from here, y, x divided by y, remainder should be less than or equal to Wonderful. So X, there are 40 possibilities. Y, there are only 5 possibilities. I'm going to think about Y first. Quite simple. Now, if Y were equal to 1, then the remainder would be 0. So Y equal to 1 would work completely. That is, any value of X, Y equal to 1 will work. Y equal to 2, possible remainders are 0 and 1. Therefore, remainder is less than or equal to 2, that also works. Y equal to 3, possible remainders are 0, 1, that will also work y equal to 4 possible remainders are 0 1 2 3 now here we have an issue y equal to 5 remainders possible are 0 1 2 3 4 here also we have an issue and out of the five possibilities for y in three instances no matter what x we select the condition is met Remember, each of these is equally likely. 1 by 5, 1 by 5, 1 by 5, 1 by 5, 1 by 5. The first three 1 by 5s are in the bag. You selected y as 1, 2 or 3, then it, x simply does not matter, it's in the bag. Now think about y equal to 4. And when y is 4, we are worried about the remainder being 3. Now 1 to 40, there are 10 sets of 4 each. And 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, and so on. 1, 2, 3, 4, the remainders are 1, 2, 3, 0. 5, 6, 7, 8, remainders are 1, 2, 3, 0. So, the remainder will be 3 in exactly 1 fourth of the cases. Because 40 is a multiple of 4, life is easy. And so, in this set of 1 by 5, 1 fourth of the cases won't work for us. 3 fourth will work. Wonderful. The remainder could be 0, 1 or 2. Our condition is satisfied. Same idea. Here the remainder could be 0, 1 or 2. 3 or 4 does not satisfy the condition. Since 40 is a multiple of 5, we are going to have 8 sets of 5 each. 40 is 5 into 8. In each of those, 3 out of 5 works for us. Or 3 fifth works for us. Or the probability we are looking for 1 by 5 plus 1 by 5 plus 1 by 5 plus 3 fourth of 1 by 5 plus 2 fifth of 1 by 5. This is 0 0.6. This is 3 by 20 plus 2 by 25. 2 by 25 is 0 0.08. 3 by 20 is 0 0.08. 1 5 20 into 5 is 100 3 into 5 is 15 0 0.15 plus 0 0.08 plus 0 0.6 0 0.75 0 0.83 or am i making a mistake somewhere not 2 by 5 this should be 3 by 5 3 by 5 here wonderful so this is 3 by 25 which is 0.12. I did not find the 0.83. So I figured this should have been some mistake. 0 0.6 plus 0 0.27, 0 0.87. This works. Brilliant. The denominator could be 1, 2 or 3. We don't have to worry about the numerator. Worry about the number we are dividing. If the divisor is 1, 2 or 3, not the denominator. The divisor were 4 or 5, then we will have to worry about it. Divisor at 4, 3 fourths of the cases will work. Divisor were 5, 3 fifths of the cases will work. Simplify, we are through. Wonderful, wonderful, excellent question. Gosh.